Hey guys, thanks so much for clicking on the video. This is another tag video. I love these tag videos. I really do. Um, this one, y'all probably going to laugh at me real good because as much as I tell you guys that I love music, and I do, I love, 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 love music, all different kinds of music. Though, I'm not a big rap music fan, but um, this was, this tag is called um, Five Rappers. And I was tagged by uh, my girl, The Ghetto View. And I'm going to go ahead. I'm going to give a shot. And I'm going to tell you which rappers that I like. And don't judge me and don't be laughing. All right. So I'm going to do five male and five female. Um, My five male rappers that I like, I have to say, I do love LL Cool J. Likes LL Cool J for various reasons. I like LL Cool J. Always did. Um, Busta Rhymes. I like Busta Rhymes. Busta's, the beats, it's more so the beats behind Busta and Busta's visual effects. Busta Rhymes was the shit back in the day. And, you know, the, he still, the last things that I seen him do, the little song he did with Chris Brown was hot. You know, when Busta Rhymes stuff, it makes you want to dance. Again, I'm not so much into their, their lyrics. Um, but it's all, you know, my likes were always about their visual and the dance aspect of it because I like to party. So, um, okay, don't laugh. But I loved MC Hammer. I did. I loved MC Hammer. Loved everything just about that he did because they used to bug. They used to get the goddamn party started. Him and that, um, oh, what was the name of the girl group? Um, Oh, I can't even think of the name of their their group, but it was three of it was the two there was two or three of them that were dancers behind him, and they were so goddamn bad. And then they came out with a song. I can't think of their name, but anyway, I like MC Hammer. I like Common. Common is sharp. Common is smart as hell. Um, and he just Common has this vibe that you just can't you know you just get caught up in it. Common is the shit. And I absolutely loved Outkast. Outkast is the shit. They're the shit together. They're the shit apart. They Outkast. I have to say they're they're probably my absolute favorites because Andre three thousand and Big Boy even separated out. They're the shit. They really really are. Um, okay, it is what it is. Those are my males. My females. I have to say, Little Kim, naturally. And it was really her first album. Little Kim's first album, I liked the whole album all the way through. Um, and then Foxy Brown, same thing. Her first album, all the way through. Um, I do like Nicki Minaj, and it's more Nicki's aesthetic than anything else. I, lo I love Nicki's gimmick. I think she's a, a beautiful girl. She really is. She's a beautiful girl. A bitch has a face that was made for makeup. Any color combination. Um, I just think she's gorgeous. And her aesthetic, I, I really like. Um, her It's her gimmick. I, I like it. Um, Missy Elliott, of course. Missy Elliott, you can't help but give Missy some because Missy is so damn talented. Tell she, She's like damn near genius. I like Missy Elliott. Um, and I'm going to throw this one in there, which was actually the first female rapper, which is Millie Jackson. Millie Jackson was the first female rapper. She rapped. She literally rapped. Um, it was a different time, a different time period. She, she was so ridiculous. You, they couldn't even play her stuff on the radio. You know, they wouldn't play her on the radio and stuff. But if you want to trace her back, she's in YouTube. Look her up on YouTube if you don't know her stuff. Millie Jackson was the shit back in the day. She sang and, you know, the same shit that they're doing now. She's like Nikki and them. She sang and she also rapped. Her raps were really, really raunchy. The shit that she said was really raunchy. And you're thinking, we're talking like in the 70s. And she has this song called um, I Had to Say It. And she basically, a part of the song, she talks about basically white women and black men and how when black men get a little money, 
they go on over to the other side. And, you know, you see that a lot in, like, athletes. That's always something that is, is always coming up. And, you know, I mean, I'm not making it up. I'm not trying to offend anybody. It is what it is. You see it. But I'm trying to remember one of the lines in the song. Where she would say, um, the line. The line goes, we, we done waited 400 years to get rid of our cotton sack. White man finally let you make some money and you dummies give it all back. So she was saying shit that was like, oh, no, you didn't. You know what I mean? <laughs> so I have to say Millie Jackson. And uh, oh, I got another one I got to throw in. I'm sorry. Salt and pepper. I did like salt and pepper. Salt and pepper was the shit. So sorry, guys. Those are six. Um, salt and pepper was the shit back in the day. I liked them. But that's basically, that's it. I'm going to tag um, Miss Delightful 72, because she's a lover of music as well. So Miss, Miss Delightful 72, baby, you've been tagged. All right, guys. Thanks. See you guys later. Bye.